My husband was such a horrible man. I'm not surprised that somebody finally decided to kill him. He was a greedy lecher who didn't know how to properly treat a lady. However, I most certainly did not kill him. All of his fortune is willed to our daughter who is away at college. I won't see a penny. At about 7.30, my husband excused himself to go to the bathroom. Probably ten minutes passed and he hadn't returned. So, Bruce, I mean, Sir Indigo, went to check on him. When Bruce didn't come back right away, I went to see what was going on. My husband was lying on the bathroom floor, pale as a ghost. And Bruce, the deer, was trying his best to resuscitate him. I was at the table the whole time. Bruce, I mean, Sir Indigo didn't leave the table until my husband has already been gone for quite a long time. Azura was in and out between the kitchen and the dining room all night. Miss Pearl had excused herself three or four times, for about ten minutes at a time, during the course of the evening, once shortly after she got here, once before dinner, and once right at the end of dinner. She got back the last time only moments before my husband excused himself. However, I don't believe that she ever went in the direction of the bathroom. Count Blanco, that impatient lout, went into the kitchen several times to see what was taking the food so long. I swear, I think he went in there before every course. Madame Ismilda, that crazy old bat, just sat at the end of the table mumbling to herself and drinking all of my favorite wine.